I joined the military as soon as they had let me. One of my first uh, duty stations was in Central America. Jumped into Panama, jumped into Grenada. You know, by the time I was 17 years old, I was in the jungle. Never really thought about not coming back. I always figured I'd make it back. My name is Anselmo Sanchez Ortiz. People call me Rocky, and I'm from Dallas, Texas. I grew up just a couple of miles from here. I've been here all my life uh, now, except for the 20 years in the military. That's the only time I've ever left. I was 11 Bravo uh, in the Army, which is infantry. So I was a frontline troop for the whole time I was there. You know, I loved getting up in the morning, going on a run, breakfast at six, you know, I mean, I absolutely loved my military service. The transition coming back to civilian life is pretty steep. I mean, you know, it's like mountains and mohills. In the military, you got rank and structure. In civilian life, you know, no, not so much. After the military, I wanted to be an a &P, which is airframe and power plant mechanic. But the challenge just wasn't there, really. I tried different things. The only structure I felt like I had was going back to welding. My father had a welding shop when I was growing up. And from the time I was eight years old, it was literally helping him weld. For me, it's easy, you know? I mean, it's, it's what I've been doing for a long time. It's hot, dirty, heavy work. But I mean, like I said, for me, it's, it's what I do. What I like about my job is it's something new every day, really. The most fulfilling is just getting the job done. So I started working for WorkRise in 04. They've always kept me busy. They've put me on some of the best jobs here in the Metroplex. I had a great career in the military. And coming around here, you know, and, and working, I've just been lucky, really. After a hard day's work, me and my girlfriend love to go to the cover club and play pool. I always, you know, think about how I can be more of a gentleman to her. I think it just grows and grows every day. The little things in life that make me happy is just taking the time to do them. I mean, because you'll just, you just never know, you know. And I'm glad to be still living and loving and working. Still writing my story.